What's up, everybody? It's Twisted Heat Gaming bringing y'all another build. This is a storm build. I know it's not my Rangers. I'm so used to playing with the Rangers that I forgot how fun the storm can be. But I'm going to show y'all. This is a more in your face storm build. This is not a sit back and prime everything for everybody else to hit storm build. So let's get into it. All right. This is a hailstorm renewal. This is upgrade. Ice Blast hurls chunks of ice. Defeating an enemy instantly restores 75% of your shield. Like I said, in your face storm build, 75% of the shield is awesome. It's an awesome gimme. Now we got plus 5% gear speed, plus 8% ammo pickup, AMNT. Plus 20% machine pistol damage. I don't use the machine pistol with this build. So we're all good on that. And for this gear specifically, we have plus 150% gear damage. Okay, that's a huge chunk. Huge chunk. This is a primer as well. It doesn't say that it's a primer, but it freezes on contact. So not only does it give huge damage, plus the extra 150% gear damage for this, it primes them for a nice combo going down here to my focus seal I'm rocking black ice it's an upgraded glacial spare combo effect chain hitting enemies freezes others nearby now mind you this detonates the prime target but it freezes everybody around them it's a it's a freeze prime combo people like come on you can't get better than that let's go we have plus 25% gear speed for the overall javelin. Makes my stuff come back so much quicker. So much quicker. I'm telling you. We got plus 12% uh, repair AMNT. We got plus 20% shotgun damage, which is awesome because I rock the pop a pump with this build, people. You can't do nothing without the pop a pump. Everybody needs to pop a pump. Let's go. We got plus 25% L1 damage l1 is this bad boy right here so that's an extra 25 percent it's 175 percent gear damage people just for the hailstorm that's extra let's go yeah so that's all that right there that goes hand in hand with the overall javelin that whole whole inscription area overall javelin you know now we're gonna go down to the weapons Everybody know the storm needs the elemental rage. At least one weapon on the storm has to be the elemental rage, people. Come on. We got a leg legendary assault rifle. Upgraded defender. Standard issue freelancer rifle. Veterans fear. Hitting elite enemies increases all, all elemental damage by 5% for 10 seconds. Stacks up to 20. That's a 100% extra damage, people. 100%. This puts out hella work when it comes to my elements. I'm telling you. We have overall javelin plus 85% armor, which comes in handy when the shields get low. For this specific gear, we have plus 28% weapon aim. We have plus 21% weapon reload speed. That comes in handy too. The faster you reload, more damage you can put out. And yeah. Helps a lot. <laughs> and we got 21% damage overall for everything on the javelin. Overall damage. Oh no, oh no. Oh no, we can't back out. Forgot this guy here. Yeah, the Papa. It's an upgraded scatter shot. Standard issue Lancer shotgun. Reloading increases force and delivers bonus damage of 100% for 15 seconds. Stacks twice. That's two. 100% damage people we have plus 100% armor max for the overall javelin we have 90% weapon mag size it gives me 19 instead of 10 people 19 in the magazine instead of 10 putting damage down range all the time I'm telling you we got plus 33% luck which is always a bonus everybody need a little luck you know and we got 150% weapon damage put like I said putting out damage that's 350% possible 
full weapon damage on this gun itself, people. Come on, man. I'm telling you. This whole build synergizes, people. It synergizes hand in hand with each other. I'm telling you. It's good. It's good stuff. Softened blows is a legendary universal component. Increases javelin shield by a large amount. Increases damage resistance by 75% for 5 seconds when shield gets low. Now we all know how squishy that the storms are. So that's 75% when the shields run out. Most likely if your shields run out, your armor is just a blink away. <laughs> I'm telling you, we all know this and we played play the storm. Your armor is just a blink away. So that's 75% is a great bonus lose your shields pump down two three more shots or whatever take cover recharge your shit come right back we back in the fight people i'm telling you all right now we got overall javelin 27 percent combo damage with an additional 19 percent combo damage add that together people add that together what's that 46 46 percent extra oh i'm down with it i'll take it all right mark of wrath all right increases gear damage by 50 percent and lowers re uh gear recharge rate by 20 uh by 20 percent now as y'all seen earlier i have an inscription on a prior gear piece that has plus 25 percent recharge rate anyway so this is doing nothing this is doing nothing. I still have an extra 5%. An extra 5% recharge rate. Okay. So yeah. That negative right there does nothing to me. Detonating the combo causes large electrical explosions. Now we have. Plus 20% heavy pistol ammo. I don't have a heavy pistol here. But this plus 5% ice effect comes in handy. It's not a lot. But you need as much as you can get if you want these 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 javelins to work the way you need them to work. You want as much laying towards your javelin that you're working with as possible. All right. Yeah, we got the acid slugs. I need my shotgun to prime people simply because I am a up close and personal with this build. I need my shotgun to prime. I'm in and out. I don't just stand there and shoot, shoot, shoot like I would my ranger. I'm in and out. But when I do get in there, I do prime. Okay. Now this adds a specialized storage for enhanced uh, enhanced shotgun ammunition. Increases damage by 30%. That's another 30%, people. So an overall extra, what's that? Let me see, 350. Add that, that's 380% extra damage for the shotgun. Come on. Hitting seven shotgun shots in a single burst applies acid on the target. So it primes. So... Everything I have primes and detonates. My detonator primes itself. Okay. And my primer, it doesn't detonate, but it causes massive damage. It's not even supposed to be a a, a primer, I don't think. But since it freezes, it primes. <laughs> so, like, everything on me is a primer. And it's crazy. Uh, we have plus 85%. Uh, shield max comes in handy always shielded armor always comes in handy take it when you can get it man take it when you can get it trust me uh plus five percent elemental resistance all elemental resistance is key if you get it work with it if you get it work with it you'll run into a lot of elements fire electric uh ice all right all of it take it when you can get it the gunslinger is marked all right, we got increased gear recharge rate by 50%. Increased gear recharge rate by 50%. Come on now. My <laughs> my stuff comes back so fast, it's ridiculous. And y'all see that in the gameplay after this. Trust and believe me. Uh, and it lowers gear damage by 20%. With all of the synergy I got going on, you never even noticed that minus 20%. You never even notice it. Hovering increases all weak point damage. Now, like I said, I don't sit all the way in the back. I do hover, but I'm more close to the fight than anything. I do hover from time to time, though, so that does work out. Um, we have negative 6% shield delay. 
which means it comes back 6% faster. Okay, and we have plus 20% ultimate speed. Gives me my ultimate back 20% faster. I'm pretty sure y'all know what this is, but I gotta tell you just to keep it going in your head. Alright, we have the Amulet of Winter increases ice damage by 5% and ice effect by 5%. Applying ice effects increase weapon damage by 30% for 20 seconds. So if I chose to swing out my shotgun, I'm at 400% extra damage with my shoddy people. With the shoddy. Come on. Pop is crazy. I'm telling you. It just loads up. It just loads up. And it also gives me a boost to, to my elemental rage. So it gives me that boost of damage from, from my elemental rage while I'm stacking up to cause damage with my ice. It's, man, test it out, man. It's so fun. I'm telling you. Um, we have plus 15% repair drop rate and we have plus 23% weapon ammo. You can't go wrong with ammo. You can't go wrong with ammo. Get it when you get it. All right. So we got the token of the pupil. The pupil. <laughs> oh, that sounded funny. Increases the number of combo chains by two. Hitting an enemy with L1 increases R1 by 60% for 10 seconds. Damage. Damage. Man. <laughs> this build puts out hella damage. We got plus 10% overheat delay recovery. Uh, I am pretty much too worried about that. Because I don't fly around enough to overheat. And we all know how long the goddamn storm can hover. So I don't think we, I don't think any of us worry about actually overheating with the storm. We have the plus 10% ice effect. Always good with an ice build. Always good. And we're going down here to my support seal. I'm running a wind wall. Creates a wall of wind at a set position that blocks projectiles. It works. I will say that it does work to a point because <laughs> if you get enough people hitting it, yeah, it's it's up and then it's down. But I use this more or less to block stuff from coming at me while I'm rec while I'm reviving a teammate. All right. So this is plus 15 percent armor max. Yep. I'll take that armor. We got plus 15 percent repair AMT and we got plus. <clears throat> plus 17 percent i'm sorry plus 17 percent heavy pistol ammo i don't run a heavy pistol um this quick in the field beside me seems like a more legit uh thing to use but as you can see the wind wall gives me the extra health you know and it lasts 10 seconds longer and it has armor on it so yeah that's what i would rock well, folks, that's the build. Hope y'all enjoyed it. Hope y'all will enjoy it. <laughs> Test it out. Try it out. It's the Iceman, people. It's just something I, I threw together last night. And I've been running it since then. It's fun as hell. Make sure y'all hit that like. Smash that subscribe. Feel free to comment. Leave any suggestions you want to leave. It's your boy, Twisted Heat. I'm out of here. Peace. <laughs>
levels are dropping. You're halfway there. 